Hey everybody, Daniel Fusco here, and welcome to today's Two Minute Message. One of the centerpieces of the teachings of the Bible is forgiveness. And I believe that the reason that is is because we live in a fallen world, a broken world, where people make mistakes. The Bible calls that sin. And those mistakes have tremendous consequences as it relates to relationships. Our relationship with God, our relationship with ourselves, and our relationship with the people around us. And because we live in a world that has been warped by sin, that is broken, that is fallen, our mistakes There's always severing in all these relationships. And that's why the Bible puts such a premium on forgiveness because everything is broken because of sin. But then Jesus came to die on a cross for the sins of the world to fix what has been broken. to to take what has been severed and to put it back together. And really Jesus does that by by dying on a cross and being resurrected from the grave. When we believe in him, now we have forgiveness with God. And so now our relationship with God is fixed. And then when our relationship with God is fixed, the way we see ourselves gets fixed. We're able to not only forgive ourselves for what we've done because God has forgiven us, but we also get to be able to see ourselves properly that without seeing ourselves through the lens of the cross, now all of a sudden our view, our vision and our view of ourselves is warped. And then it also gives us the opportunity to be able to forgive other people who have wronged us and also to, to be able to acknowledge when we've wronged someone, say, hey, listen, I'm so sorry. I messed that up. Will you please forgive me, right? And we need forgiveness in a broken world because everybody is flawed except for Jesus. And so God wants us to receive forgiveness in Jesus and then also walk in that forgiveness and offer it to other people. And also when people mess up and they say, hey, listen, will you, you, know, will you forgive me? We, we receive it from other people as well when they acknowledge what they've done. So we want forgiveness to be the centerpiece. That's what we do. I want you to share this video because all of us, everyone we all know has situations that forgiveness is needed and it's only found in Jesus. And in the comment section, I want you to talk about what you understand forgiveness to be and how Jesus, in the way he is handling you through what he has done on the cross, how that is transforming your life because of so great a salvation. And God bless you today.